Hello, this reading is for Pisces. Pisces, let us see what is the energy that is coming or building around you. Coming, building, same thing. <laughs> let us see. Any messages in the long or short term? Anything about love, life, money? Affirmations, cautions, or heads up? Let's see, Pisces. Two of Cups. Knight of Wands, the Sun. That's exciting energy. It feels good right there. But let's go and see what they break down to. Two of Cups. Pisces we'll find out if this is a restart or you are just progressing onto a very busy market a very busy market where you're seen in, in high demand we'll find out Knight of Wands I got four. We'll take them. Knight of Wands gets six of Wands, eight of Swords, eight of Cups. I do not like that too much. <laughs> Pisces, this almost looks like under Knight of Wands energy that somebody who left is going to come back and is there saying, now I'm going to do right. Oh, we'll find out, Pisces. Like, I left, I'm back. Oh, it seems like that. Let's go into the sun. Three of Cups, Knight, or Second Knight, Knight of Pentacles, and a High Priestess. Oh, is that work? You got three Knights out here, Pisces. It's a lot of movement. Okay, let's get into our Two of Cups. Oh, Pisces, is this a past person? We'll take a peek at that Ten of Swords and see how final it is. Is that situation done done? No. Well, maybe I'll throw two more. Page of Pentacles, excuse me, a Page of Cups up there is kind of showing somebody's back for round two. I mean, we already know if something's ended, you're moving on to something else. Uh, this feels to me like someone has ended it, but the other person, somebody coming towards you, Pisces. They say, okay, that ended, but now we can be better. Two more on that. Yeah, somebody's had a realization. I'm going to throw one other cards on these two, but I think that's it. Knight of Cups. Four of Swords. This person has thought about it. Five of Wands. Death. This person wants another chapter with you. Pisces will just take the message here know that you do have a past person back if I was to aspect this well you know ten of swords is what it is five of swords excuse me five of wands is what it is four of swords also is what it is this is not the best two of cups energy I will say as well for reconciliation this is still kind of you know I've seen better. I felt better. It's kind of average. And more than anything, I feel this Two of Cups is a little hassling for you. It's like the validation that this past person is coming to you with Pisces. Now you don't need it. 
I think it would have been nice if this came before for you. But for this person and who it applies to in the Piscean Collective, you know, it's, it's a little too late. Maybe this person too, I wonder with the feelings I get. Maybe they specifically waited. Maybe this person specifically waited this amount of time too, so that the issue of the ending, you would be detached from it, you would be healed from it to a certain extent, so that they could feel like at least you'd listen to them. When before, when it was too raw, if it, they came back too soon, You'd be like, no. But I feel also, too, with this five of wands energy in here, while they allowed that time, while they allowed that time to go on of separation of this situation, they were still exploring their options. So know that, Pisces. This person just wasn't waiting, pining, no. They were calculating and exploring and seeing what else was out there. That's what this person was doing. Anyway, yes, yeah, so although a situation you may have thought ended, did it end with this person? As I mentioned before, I really do feel this person allowed the length of time to go by for their advantage. But all the while it ended, the separation, I do feel that they went around and shopped. They, uh, their initial feeling, whatever you want to call it, realization of your connection just became more and more clear to them. So this person is going to come to you to a restart. Quite powerful energy here, Pisces 2, for a restart. King of Wands, Knight of Cups, the Death card. This person is going to come very charming back to you. This person is going to charm you. They're going to try and... They're going to try and woo you. Like some gallant romantic figure. This Four of Swords not only refers to the length of separation of this Ten of Swords situation, but also the thought they put into it. It's a sure thing for them to come back and make this offer to explore the possibilities. How direct they will be? I wonder, Pisces, because this energy is pretty direct. King of Wands with Judgment, that's pretty direct. The page softens it, makes it more casual. Page of Cups with Knight of Wands, excuse me, um, King of Wands. We do have a Knight of Wands over there. <laughs> page of Wands with King of Wands. It's a little playful, which is... You know, playing a little games. I think that they'll be forward up to a point. But they're not going to reveal, I feel, the great realization that you are the one. Not until they're sure, because they're coming in cautious page of cups energy. They don't want to lose out. Anyway, this person is coming back know that this person expects a little resistance going in there but as I mentioned before I feel this five of wands energy also speaks to the options they explore while they're away they're ready for the challenge They're more than ready for the challenge to try and get back into your energy, back into your physical space, back into your active attention, Pisces. This 
go and see this message. We have another night. Somehow this feels like the same type of message. Pisces. Slightly different nuances. Someone is coming back. Oh, how do you feel about this person, Pisces? I don't think you feel very positively about them. I think they bring you down into a low vibration. This person left. Just said, oh, that's too much for me. I'm out of here. Didn't even say goodbye. Or if they did, maybe they said goodbye through some device. Some words. And now they're back. So let's go and take a little peek into this. We'll take a little peek. Oh, what should we clarify first, Pisces? I want to know about the Eight of Swords. Is the Eight of Swords their hesitation or your hesitation? Let's clarify that. One second. Eight of Swords. King of Pentacles. That person left you after all. King of Pentacles. Two of Wands. They left to see what was out there. So that could either be you waiting for them to come back or them waiting to come for you back with Nine of Wands, Four of Cups. I think this is them. This is them waiting to come back, the right way to come back after leaving. See, they real. well, I'll get into it in a minute. Let's see, is there anything more to go and clarify? I don't think so, Pisces. We have the gist of it. So, Pisces, I think you know someone. I believe some of you know someone who you are in a very deep relationship with. Maybe you were living together. Maybe you just saw this person as someone who you would naturally progress into a partner, like a marriage partner. You know, you had that kind of serious relationship. You had a serious relationship with this person. And oddly, Pisces, that person had other plans. That's what I see here. And I believe that when that person or how that person expressed those plans to you, I think it took you by surprise. I say how. I believe that person left. Rather one-sidedly here with Eight of Cups energy. Eight of Cups is such a nasty energy usually. It's cold. I do believe this person has now been... I kind of feel this weight is on both of your sides, just of the situation. However, I feel this is this, this person's energy, this person coming towards you in Knight of Wands energy. Very fiery energy here under Four of Cups. What kind of labor did this person have to put in? Some more fire energy here for a fresh start. This person is now willing to go and put in energy. This person is coming under ace, like this movement here, Pisces. It's this massive energy that this person is coming to you at. 
I don't know if it's a fire or air sign. No, excuse me, fire or earth sign. But lots of fire. Yeah. I don't know if it's fire or earth. Or strong placements. Especially prominently Venus, Moon, Sun. It could be Mars. So, yes, this person is coming back to offer you commitment. Again, I don't know how you feel about this because how this person left was feels here kind of nasty. They left one side of the. It was their decision and they didn't give you any time to process it really. I said, this is what's best for me. And they're one-sided like that. Okay, let's get into message number three. The sun. Let's go and see what this night is all about. Knight of Pentacles. Oh, it looks like love. Another love message, Pisces. Three of Swords, Six of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. Someone wants to do right by you. I dare say, Pisces, because this energy is falling under Sun. And we have the Three of Cups here as well. This is someone who you want to see. This is someone who you still feel for very strongly they broke your heart but you still want to see them and this person is coming back this is a new person we'll find out let's see if it's that person or someone else either way I have the sun here so I'm seeing sun with my other indications we're talking about someone who you view as a possible life partner Yeah, somebody's coming back. High Priest is clarified. So, Pisces, what I see. The sun, even bottom of the deck energy, the justice. This is someone who you want to see, Pisces. I don't know about the, for this, that se second message. That was definitely someone who you who really hurt you and you're still not healed from that. You don't know how you feel about that person because that person left you. This is different. I feel with this person they did hurt break your heart, no doubt about that. I do feel, however, that you're going to be really thrilled that this person is back. This person is acknowledging their bro the broken heart they caused. They want to try and establish proper, healthy relationship dynamics. They see you. They feel very strongly about you as well. I do think with this energy here, you feel very strongly about this person. You want to see this person. This person is coming back in night of... Pentacles energy. Hi, Priestess. Yeah, this person definitely broke your heart. Both of you are disappointed over how the situation turned out. Which is why the person is back for another start. I don't know if you're dealing with... Again, it could be a fire, air... Not fire, air. Why do I keep on saying air? fire, earth, or water. <laughs> so yes, I mean, uh, I don't know. Could it be a Libra? I doubt it. I mean, anything is possible. Or it could be somebody with really strong placements of fire, of earth, or cancer. Placements somewhere in their, pro their personal planets. 
more prominent planets. Yes, Pisces, those are the messages I have for you today. Let me know if they resonate. If they do, like or leave a comment. If you would like to see more content from me, subscribe. If you have already subscribed, thank you so much for helping our channel grow. Pisces, if you'd like, you could treat me to a coffee. Here's a link in the description box. And until the next video, which I will do some week energy reads over the weekend, I'll release that. And I'll try and get to like, a, you know, the single um, person on your mind, see if your next love is coming. I'll roll out a few of those too. So keep your eye out for those, okay? Until the next video, I am wishing everybody a beautiful day. Bye-bye.